Alright, welcome back to Battlestar Galactica. And we're gonna take on this little mission here. Cylon strike group has been detected. Precarnate. So hopefully the thing of the missions being easier than the um, random spawns continues. I did that one that last round that spawned quite nicely. Oh, so far it's better numbers for me. Good. I don't need at least one Raptor Squadron. I'm going to put two down. Just because sometimes these landing missions can get a bit hairy. And that's not what we want, is it? Prepare to jump in three, two, one. Jump complete. Cylons are on the board. I'm getting some weird reads from their ships. They are forces from Cylon Command. Lachis is his own personal guard. They know there is value in this facility, if not what it is. Commander, launch Raptors and have our Marines board the station as soon as there's a clear runway. Yes, Commander. Alright. Defensive for the first turn. Yes, sir. I hope this will give me a couple of turns to get my fighter now. Weapons free and by the numbers, folks. Alright, they've not launched any squadrons of our own, so you begin firing on that one. Francis. Board. The Monophyst facility. Nasty view. you Squadron can't have a look at him. Confirmed. Disarming. Time to make a bunch of mama toasters cry. Is there a minefield here? IFF confirms unit is hostile. Fighter squadron is taking fire. Alright, let's peel off three squadrons. Yes, sir. Now, please. Five missions and seven. Next turn. The Revenant, fine. The Revenant doesn't carry any uh, missiles. If I knew it was going to survive more than one turn, I wouldn't have asked. Target acquisition is screwed. Give me manual controls now. Now we pick out the Raptors. Here we go. Dreadus contacts. More units have jumped inside our engagement range, sir. We've shown our hand now. I hope you trust Kane to do this right, Lena, because I'm not sure that I do. All right. Swingy, swingy. Back to full defensive. Get that red radius up. Focus fire on that target. Hawkins. They look like borders to me. You guys are not like that. They are peace. That's your target. They're definitely doing some. Optimizing firing solution. That's a long fire missile. Hopefully, I'll get those turns in flap up. Will Jupiter Jupiter Minerva Clack on the right and just rotate slightly to make sure all your missiles are in range. Okay. 
Pay out please, find munitions into the Cerberus. Something packs on him. Scrambler. Marines aboard the station. No contact inside. Sounds like a real mess in there, probably abandoned for some time. Glad I talked my way out of having to go on point for this one. You're a flag officer, you shouldn't be young on point. The most annoying thing they do in sci fi shows. They should have two crews, and one, one of them should be the ones who are responsible for getting out of shit. I mean, they should have left flag officer characters and more. Um. Go on. Go on. Get him, get him. Get him. That with their scrambler going coming. up, that's fine. I wasn't planning on launching any missiles. Commander, we've got another wave of Dreadus contacts. All hostile. Okay. Now peace. Black target. Whatever that unidentified is, it's probably another raider. But for now, we're just going to take out a nemesis. Phobos. Slightly more modern carrier with a huge stock of missiles. Marines have confirmed access to the code test beds. I'm setting up the data transfer now. This. Yeah, this is going to take a while. The data set is big. There is a faster alternative, Lieutenant. Locate my reversion host and use it to download and store the data locally. We can alter the MCP's transfer protocols to accommodate the size of the data set. That is a horrible idea. Except it would probably work. We could literally just walk out with the data. This facility should be a priority one target. We're here to stop the Cylons, not collaborate with them. Lachesis will learn how you intend to locate them. They will adjust their behavior accordingly, and render this entire endeavor null. The first and last you will ever see of them will be at their complete subjugation of your colonies. Admiral, the only advantage you have right now is the speed at which this dataset can be processed, and your plan to confront Lachesis formulated. Do it. Tell them to find the robot and use it to transfer the data. Lord, help me if this is what sinks us. How to say that was a good pun. Gas flak, flak up on the left. Focus fire on that Phobos. ARPs. Buy munitions into that Phobos. That's about it for that flank, isn't it? Oh yeah. Select target. Ah, uh, I should have had flak up on both sides. It's okay. Hostile unit identified. Marines have found and connected the Clothos reversion host. The tech crew is overriding the MCP with the lab's data set now. Alright, thank you. They are definitely putting up a good old fire, All right? ARPs. Recall. Trigger zone detected. Alert squadron. That'll be another Phobos and then a good missile. At least with this speed change, I've got a much larger flak area. Alright, it's time to rotate towards the target. ARPs. We'll be back in next turn. Missiles incoming! Necessary battery. Full tack mode. Fire at will. Come on, Transfer is complete. Marines have the package and are returning to Raptors. Wait for clearance and then blow the station. Admiral, there is decades of research in that facility. Neural networks, probability models. 
quantum processing. Most of the technology in there is as yet unused by any Cylon agent. You would destroy the library to kill a cockroach. In this case, the cockroach is worth killing. Right. So, put a fire on the station. Launch all squadrons. And enter, I guess. Squadron has gone dark. Alright. Your chance to get through that flight wall are pretty small. Hostile unit identified. Alright, focus right, fire on the nemesis. I think. One turn. Three turns. And no missiles, so I can drop my flag for a turn. And fire munitions into that throw boss. Shot by point zero six. Fire. Switching out the manual. All right, rotate. Yes, commander. Focus fire on the Cerberus. Clear the skies. Fine, a little bit of damage is okay by me. Board is clear and the facility is destroyed. I've got Tex in the hangar waiting to receive the... Uh, the... Clothos. Take this one back to the brig until we need it again. Lieutenant Agathon, I want to know what we can get from that dataset within the hour. Dismissed. Alright. That should give me enough to unlock the, um... Let's do this first. Can you... Can you move this thing? It's just standing there, in the way. I am conserving the host's energy. I assume you would prefer not to deplete its stores and lose access to the data set before we have completed the transfer. As if you aren't somehow communicating between yourselves anyway. I am not. The host is lifeless. It's MCP idle. I'd only be talking to myself. That's kind of my point. That thing is you. You and it have to be... linked, somehow. That host is not me, Lieutenant. Until I die, this body retains my consciousness. It is impossible for someone to inhabit two bodies at once. A conscious mind is indivisible. Unless my dead man switch triggers that host specifically, it will never talk. That's another thing I don't get about you. Why talk out loud? Why not just send your thoughts to each other over a network like any other computer? Language is a conceit of the living. To communicate ideas without language as the medium would be perfect. Infallible. Only God is infallible. It can't be that simple. We have to believe that you don't use this massive advantage over us just because of... because of faith? Why not be that simple? Our shared fallibility should provide you some comfort. Thank you for this discussion, Lieutenant. It is clear to me now that I must speak with Lachesis if we are to prevent their annihilation of the human race. A chat. That's your big idea. You go talk with it and it decides, yeah, sure, drop tools and peace for all. No, no, no. Say that we figure out where it is. Find a way to get you face to face without being shot out of the sky. How do you even begin that conversation? What do you say? I... I do not yet know. Ah, I see the bad ideas. Right. Blueprints. Oh, that's annoying. I have to do that other little mission, aren't I? Okay, the... The side mission is... Admiral, Commander, I finished running simulations with the data set we took from Geminon. Our best option of getting Clothos face-to-face -face with Lachesis is the staging ground at Persephone. If the IL isn't there, Clothos will have the best chance of finding its location from the Cylon signal traffic. That's not what we're doing here, Lieutenant. We're not here to hand over its deputy. You've gotten too close. Listen to its sideways logic. We will find Lechesis, and we will take it out for good. That will not happen, Admiral. 
Lachesis is escalating, but they are not yet ready for a direct confrontation with Colonial Fleet. They will elude you the moment you mount an assault. You will lose many lives, and still have gained nothing. The plan is already set. We're using the resources available to us. We'll hold the robot's backup body hostage while it negotiates a ceasefire on our behalf. We can't let it go out there without a leash. You remember what it did to Jubal, to the crew of Galactica? I am a reversion, Praetor. I have no recollection of what my pre-incarnate did to you or Admiral Sarkis. By virtue of you both standing here, healthy, I do not expect the force was disproportionate. Praetor, stand down. No one here likes this, but it's the best we have to work with. The Cylons are escalating at a rate beyond anything we've ever seen. I don't intend to wait around for them to come pick us off at their leisure. You want a solution? This is it. Now get to work or get off my station. I'm actually, well, the path of talking to the Cylons, I'm actually agreeing. I don't think I can do this anything except the Galactica group. Um, and... This, this is my so so that'll be jumping them to there let's jump these guys to here I'm gonna have to end turn once new Jupiter is ready for action all right we have the Option to build another Jupiter, and then an Atlas and Ranger. Yeah, that'll be done okay carefully. That's okay, Officer. The sign done. Because I currently got a ranger here, haven't I? So if I jump to the last star to where the ranger is. Actually, no, the ranger has actually the, these all three of these are at the same point. So that's now a bigger fleet as this guy can get it without promotion. Where is it? There we go. I can't find the requisition points for the promotion. So. That is actually my problem. Don't have enough off good officers for the fleet. I don't have the requisition point for the officers to get any more. Okay. Daedalus is too expensive to jump at the moment. So I'm going to end this video and have a think and come back and I think I may just rush for that mission. See you then.